So something on my mind for a while has been problems with weekly manga. And now what I'm referring to it is a lot of the troubles that these series go through because they're actually weekly. Now one of the things that most recently has been going on, for example, is like One Piece. It'll have these chapters where it'll be like one or two things will happen, or Bleach for that matter as well. And then it feels like, okay barely anything happened and honestly one of the things that i attribute this to is the fact that it is weekly monthly mangaka they have an entire month to think what they're gonna do now granted they gotta work on it for the month or whatever but they have a lot more time to do so and some of these monthly mangaka aren't even monthly like look at the dude from berserk miura kentaro miura he takes months sometimes to research things when you have a week-to-week basis you ultimately have to think and sometimes i honestly think the approach that they take is i need more time to think so let me have one or two small things happen in this chapter and while i do that i'll keep thinking on what i'm going to do next and that's where some of the pitfalls come for this series like for example again bleach and one piece have been kind of here and there with that like bleach it'll have a super exposition driven chapter and it'll feel like not much really happened they talked and they walked or whatever and one piece a lot of times in the arcs it'll feel like a lot of times they're just running and again i think the big problem with that is because they're weekly because these authors they have to sit there and they have only a week to come up with something interesting something exciting and they have to draw it at the same time so i think one of the big pitfalls for a lot of these stories is the fact that they're weekly if you even go back to naruto with the war perfect example is when they were fighting obito a lot of the times it would be the entire chapter they knocked obito back and hashirama made a speech about you know getting everyone riled up everyone's riled up and then the next chapter will be the same thing rinse recycle repeat and again that's because they're weekly and that's the pitfalls of it like honestly i do love weekly series simply because i love getting my fix every week we all love it we all love getting the chapter or whatnot and a lot of times the reason why we're disappointed is because little to nothing happens sometimes and at at the same time to give it credit when something big happens is because we've been patient and we've been waiting and it's like fuck yeah you know sabo's here oh the soul king oh shit madara's the sage of six pass mode so there's a gift and a curse to the weekly manga but ultimately those are some of the pitfalls not to mention the quality of art a lot of the times again we'll have a really good drawn chapter or whatnot but sometimes we'll have chapters where the artist is kind of like bland like one of the things with Taite Kubo with Bleach is he'll do really awesome character designs but the backgrounds will be kind of bland and again that's due to lack of time a lot of the times they have to do all of this and at the same time they gotta look at okay well I only have this amount of time what can I strip away from it so when a lot of these chapters aren't bedazzling us like you know again going back and I keep using Berserk as an example like Berserk he has all the time in the world to draw these chapters so he makes masterpieces he makes them look absolutely gorgeous and granted that's not to say that weekly manga don't have amazing art but a lot of times if you think about it with weekly manga you'll have like maybe that last page or that one panel that looks sick as fuck and then it'll kind of go back to normal art And again, that's another pitfall from weekly manga. And I think that that's one of the big reasons why we'll have, you know, for example, with Fairy Tale, there'll be this chapter where it's just like, oh my gosh, it's just a bunch of fan service. Well, probably Hiro Mashima, well, besides the fact of, you know, we know, we know you, Hiro, we know what you be doing, but he uses that as a time to think, okay, I'm just going to throw some silly shit in here and then I'll come up with it later. And again, I think weekly manga, the biggest reason why a lot of these series have some of these issues and have these chapters where it's like, oh my gosh, you know, push, push in One Piece or in Bleach is just like they're running and eventually something's going to happen, but it hasn't happened yet. Is because they're weekly and these authors they need time so it's a gift and a curse we get the amazing surprises later on and after all the build-up and all these setups and all these things that it's like oh my gosh we got to be dazzled but at the same time you got to trudge through it so it kind of makes me wonder at the same time versus a monthly do you feel as though a monthly has more advantages and a monthly is the preferable approach i mean honestly i still prefer weekly simply because again i love getting my weekly dose of my series that i love etc etc but it's at the cost of certain amounts of quality with a monthly is like i i get more disappointed when a monthly is a bad chapter or a slow chapter or a boring chapter because it's like i get one a month and it you know it, this is what you give me so with monthlies i i guess i have higher expectations and again that just goes into the whole weekly versus monthly let me know what you guys think personally i still prefer weekly but ultimately i look at monthlies as they should be of a higher standard because they have that amount of time 
do you prefer weekly or monthly manga and why? I think that's one of the big things that while I'm talking about the problems with weekly manga, I also think that that's an interesting topic in and of itself. Which one is the better approach, weekly or monthly? Ideally, being realistic quality-wise, if you want to look at quality altogether, monthly would be the better approach. But yeah, again, I'm a weekly dude. Which one do you prefer in your overall thoughts of this subject? Personally, this is something that been on my mind for a while where a lot of manga and you know people complain, oh, this was boring and nothing happened. What the fuck are you doing? And that's why. Any overall thoughts, but that's all I have for this discussion. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you liked anything I had to say or enjoyed the video, drop me a like. I'd greatly appreciate it. And if you haven't subscribed, if you do so as well, it'd be amazing. I'm Fnub World, and as always, people, have an awesome day.